Hey guys, welcome to my channel. Uh, so today we are going to talk about multidimensional scaling. This is the fourth part of the series. Uh, and multidimensional scaling. Uh, it is a means of visualizing the level of similarity of individual cases. Information visualization, that is, uh, it refers to a set of related ordination techniques used in information visualization. In particular, to display the information contained in a distance matrix, it is a form of nonlinear dimensional reduction. Uh, MDS algorithm aims to place each object of n dimensional space between object distances such that uh, the between object distances are preserved. Uh, the object are assigned coordinates in n dimensional space and in this case dimension can exceed the value 2 but choosing n equal to 2 optimizes the object locations for a 2D scatter plot. In case of factor analysis the similarities between objects that is uh, we can see variables are expressed in a correlation matrix. With MDS, you can analyze any kind of similarities or dissimilarities in addition to the correlation matrix. So, that is all about the factor analysis and its comparison with multidimensional scaling. What is the logic behind multidimensional scaling? So, suppose we take a matrix of distances. We take a matrix of distances between uh, major cities of US from a map and we then analyze this matrix specifying that what we want to reproduce the distances based on 2D. As a result of uh, MDS analysis, we would most likely to obtain uh, 2D representations. So this is the second part, reproduce distances based on two dimensions. Uh, we would basically obtain a two-dimensional map that is obtain the 2D representation. In general, uh, this MDS attempts to arrange these objects in a space with a particular number of observ uh, with a particular number of uh, dimensions, so that to reproduce the observed distances. So, it basically moves objects around in space. Checks how well the distances between objects can be reduced and it uses a function for minimization of the algorithm. In more technical terms, uh, we can again quote this as, uh, it, is, it uses a function minimization algorithm that evaluates different configurations with the goal of maximizing the goodness of fit or we can say maximizing the goodness of fit or to minimize the lack of fit. What is goodness of fit? So goodness of fit is given by this equation where d of ij is the distances and delta of ij is the input data that are the observed distances whereas f of this is the transformation that is used that is the mathematical function now we have uh, some of the types of mds that is classic mds metric mds or non metric mds or the generalized mds what is the application of mds mds can uh, we can use mds to analyze any kind of distance or similarity matrix uh, these similarities can represent people's ratings of similarities between objects, uh, the percent agreement between judges, the number of times a subject fails to discriminate between stimuli, etc. In general, uh, MDS allows the researcher to ask relatively questions like how similar is brand A to brand B and to derive from those questions underlying dimensions without the respondents ever knowing what the researcher's real interest is. So this was all about MDS. Stay tuned for next videos guys.